What's up, people? This is Darnell Levine coming at you guys. First off, I'm doing this for Fiona Bloom and Terrence Wilmore and everybody over at Efficacy. Um, thank you guys for having me, and let's get the show started. So, the biggest highlight of my career thus far um, have to be making records. Um, that's what I love to do. I love to record. I love to write songs, record them, um, put a bunch together that makes some some type of sense, and release it. Like that's that's the biggest rush ever of my life. So yeah, that's the biggest highlight so far in my career. Just keep releasing music. Um, if I could tour with anyone, who would it be and why? Man, I want to tour with Al Green. I want to tour with Al Green. Uh, I, can anybody tell Don Levine to please um, tour with me? If he said that, I would pee pee. And then I clean myself up and then I go tour with uh, Mr. Al Green. So, yeah, Al Green. Who are some new artists you're feeling right now? If you read my blog, you would know that the new artist that I am feeling right now is Miss Avery Sunshine. She's dope. She's great. I love her. Uh, she gave me some sugar right there. Right there. I haven't watched it in a week. Okay. I'm biased, you know. She's dope. She did that right there. And, and yeah. Okay. Uh, let's see who we got. Anthony Hamilton, love that dude. Brandy Carlisle. Brandy Carlisle. Citizen Cope. That dude right there, Citizen Cope, I I ride to him all day, Citizen. Esperanza Spalding? Get out of here. If I had, let me let me get an upright bass and just get them bing fees and who's it? Let me just let me do that once. Taking over the world. Ford Exchange, dope, just dope crew of people. Gabe Dixon band. James Morrison. Johnny Lang. If y'all have never heard of Johnny Lang, look up Johnny Lang. He's not new, but he's great. Little Dragon. Mayor Hawthorne. Mayor Hawthorne. I love them dude. Detroit in the build. The big D, eh, man? I don't know nothing about Detroit, sorry. Michael Buble. Again, not new, but classic. Paolo Nutini. Dude is dope. I think he smoked a little bit, but he's dope. Ryan Leslie, dude's hustle is ridiculous. I love it. Ryan Leslie. Hopefully, I see I'm in Harlem, so. Ryan! Ryan! Nothing. So. Zach Brown Band. I, it's, it's, it's my country roots. Zach Brown Band is dope. I love him. So, Zach Brown Band. Man, I got a guilty pleasure, man. I like Drake. I'm sorry. I like Drake Drizzy. Drake Drizzy is my friend. Drake Jersey's cool. Who inspires you? Um, everything inspires me around me. Um, God inspires me. Um, whenever I'm down, whenever I'm back into a corner, that inspires me. Love is definitely kind of the anchor in a lot of my music, whether good or bad. You know, loving myself, loving other people, loving what I do. Love. Um, if I could do an ad campaign, for which brand would it be? Underwear. Underwear, Fruit of the Loom. I'm gonna leave it at that. Where do you shop for a suit? Walmart. When you think of a lens, which object comes to mind? Um, telescope. If you could bring three things to a desert island, what would it be? Oh, I hate this question. It would be uh, my piano, so I can continue to write. It would be um, my iPod with the biggest amount of space available in the history of the world and it would be um, I don't know somebody that I love I don't know I don't want to be there alone I guess it's not a thing but if I had a million dollars cash how would I spend it half would go to charity because when you give back you will never be broke and the other maybe not half but a lot um, and the rest of it will go, of course, some will go to my music career, but then some will go, you know, buy my mama house, uh, setting up my retirement, because as musicians, we, you know, sometimes forget to do that stuff because we're not in a corporation. So, you know, if I had a million in cash, I would definitely flip that million. What's my favorite word? In the face. In the face. My favorite word of all is in the face. 
if I can go back in time or forward in time like a time machine, um, who would I converse with? I would converse with um, Louis Armstrong. I want to know everything that that dude thinks and doesn't think about any and everything. Any last words or advice for aspiring artists uh, one, uh, wanting to be in your shoes? Um, aspiring artists wanting to be in my shoes, I, I think that um, nobody's shoes are too too different um, but I will give some like you know advice is that you know don't don't ever give up if you don't feel like you want to if you don't want to give up then don't give up find a plan create a plan create create um, a goal you know and 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 go after that goal study it fix it turn it over flip it to the side figure it out sometimes it doesn't happen overnight it's not happened overnight for me but you know as we all know I'm still doing it and you know it's gonna happen you know whatever that happen is for you it will happen if 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 you you know if you follow you know what you're supposed to do and you pray um, it all work out guaranteed all right. If your life, if your life was documented in a movie um, or film, what would it be called? In defense. The end. Love y'all. Don Levine signing off. Efficacy. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. Fiona Bloom, you are the world to me. I'm in New York City right now, and we are living it up. Harlem in the building.